Okay, <coughs> let's have a look at this. So we've got a satellite pass which is just about to come. I'm only using a vertical here so uh, I do have a rotator on the floor of the shack. A, uh, a Yaesu G5500 just checking that out. It's making a bit of a rattling noise occasionally as it uh, adjusts the uh, azimuth and the elevation. You see here the um, pass coming over at the moment. It's uh, heading down into the Southern Ocean. It's usually pretty good uh, down that way. Uh, we probably won't hear too many other stations on the on the pass. Maybe some uh, VK5s and some VK3s and 2s. But uh, let's see what we can do. Got the uh, TS2000 set up. As I say, I'm only running a vertical, so we're not going to get any signals for a little while. And you can uh, see the uh, Doppler shift being adjusted on that. Satellite's now in range. But uh, I really need a... Um, I really need a... Uh, a Yagi to start picking it up at this low altitude. Let's just see how much power I'm running. Uh, not really that much. I'll give it a bit of a uh, bit of power on the uplink. 437.800 is the uh, downlink frequency, and the uplink is uh, 145.980. So as you can see, the Doppler shift is uh, doing quite a bit of adjustment there. Local time is uh, just before 12 noon. So uh, you'll probably hear a couple of stations come up shortly. You hear that rotator rattling away in the background there, adjusting everything. We'll just wait a couple of minutes and um, put a call out. See what we can do. Software I'm using to control the uh, rotator. Well, here we go. It's a bit of uh, Someone's having a go there. Rotator controller software and the radio controllers using um, SatPC32 and uh, the uh, track I'm watching is using GPredict. But I can't get GPredict to work with the uh, rotator and the radio. I need to work out how to work that damn ham lib. <laughs> Let's see if, um, if we can get into it all. VK3, whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. VK3, www listening. Nothing at the moment. Just wait till it gets across a little bit further. VK3, whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. VK3, www listening. VK3 whiskey 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 VK3 www listening uh, VK5 is it echo uniform VK3 whiskey 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 Yeah, fine there, Graham. VK five EW, VK three triple W. Fine on the uh, five and nine. Also five and nine. Name here is Jack. Juliet, Alpha, Charlie, Kilo, over. Uniform, okay. No worries there, Graham. And uh, yeah, you're good for it, no, no problems at all. VK3, Triple W.
here we go. Actually, it wasn't really five and nine, but uh, yeah, here we go. Um, okay, three whiskey, 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 whiskey. No, I'm not getting in at the moment. As you can see, it's a um, very low pass. Ooh. Very low pass at the moment. And um, yeah, my little window of uh, getting in has just gone past down south of Tasmania, is uh, where I get the best, but it's a little bit far south at the moment, so the uh, elevation's a little bit low. We can get over to uh, this side here, you can get a bit of a better idea there. So we're right on the uh, limits of our um, reception. But, one contact, that's okay, but if we get the uh, the Yagis up in the air, and uh, get the rotator working, It'll be really good. I've got the rotator recording on another camera. I don't know if it's going to work or not, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, there we go. Uh, there's a VK3 to a W. Looks like we're just about to lose the um, the satellite or the space station, and um, yeah, when that uh, when that happens, hopefully I'll hear the uh, rotator park itself. Put it back to uh, wherever the park position was set for it. Another minute or so to go. Might hear a few ZLs at the moment. If we can hear, if we can receive, but uh, yeah, it's heading off out over New Zealand at the moment, directly over the top of uh, Dunedin by the look of it. Guys down in Dunedin will be uh, getting a direct overhead pass. There's something coming in at the moment. But as you can see, it's right on the limits of, uh, of me. I really need a decent, uh, <laughs> a decent 70 centimetre yard pointing that way to uh, pull something in. Bit of fun. Certainly well home in lockdown, that's for sure. Something to do in the shack. A bit different to uh, working, um, having QSOs on the uh, local repeaters and that sort of thing. Uh, just about to lose, lose it. Still a little bit of activity there. I can just hear in the background, but uh, yeah. Just then that little extra gain on the end, bit of extra gain on the end. So that's it, we've lost it now. And uh, the 
there goes a rotator in the background. It's now uh, returning the uh, rotator back to the park position. Both the azimuth and the elevation. That's it. It's all parked, ready for the next uh, the next pass.